Good morning, everyone. Today is Thursday, February. I was going to say April. It's not April yet. February 4th, 2021. My name is Karen bowden -Chotz. I serve as Associate Pastor at First Lutheran Church in Onalaska, Wisconsin, and this is my morning musing. So a couple days ago, I had the privilege of showing our interim bishop, um, Chris Berger, around our church. Um, we are going to be the production center for our Senate Assembly this year, as that will be all virtual. Um, and so he wanted to get a sense of this space. He'd never been here before. Uh, and I had an opportunity to share with him a little bit about this particular faith community and my life here as your pastor. And that um, got me thinking about what it's been like to serve you all for, are you ready for it? Nine years. And the ninth year anniversary is tomorrow. So happy anniversary, everyone. Hooray! We have had an incredible nine years. Um, I was thinking about the ways that I... Um, describe our life together. And the first is that I'm deeply grateful um, for the privilege of serving in this place and for the ways that we have walked together um, through, through life's ups and downs and normal times. Um, the ways that you have um, challenged me and helped me to grow in my faith and in my understanding um, the ways, the, the support that I have received to kind of explore some of the places that the Holy Spirit is taking me um, has been invaluable. And I love the way that my gifts are celebrated here. I love that you're willing to do some fun project um, often around art as I grew into what art meant for me and for the spirituality of who I am and who this place could be, um, that even if you weren't sure why, you still picked up a paintbrush and painted a little square on a big old canvas um, and we created art together, or you brought in your plates and let me smash them up so that we could create this incredible cross that to this day speaks to people. Um, those are two of my favorites, but there's been so many other things that we have done together. I love the joy and the laughter that we've shared, um, the ways that we've grown into what it means to be a welcoming community, what it means to be followers of Jesus has all enriched my life beyond measure. I wish my grandmother could be here to see it, both of them, um, and I, but my grandma, Mar, my grandma Brown, Marjorie was her first name. She's the one that I've probably told, I know I've told you about, that was, um, that was a, a pastor, was a circuit pastor intern in Nebraska during um, World War II. And I don't know what kind of reception she received. I don't know the struggles that she went through. But, you know, this was back in the 40s. This was long before um, women were were accepted as clergy. And um, she would go on to be a director of Christian Ed, and she would serve in California, where she met my grandfather, and um, she would be a teacher. But I know that, I, I have to suspect that it was probably not easy for her. Um, and I would love for her to see what it's like to serve here in this place or what it was like for me to serve even in my first call, which was after the first year. It took me a year to get over the culture shock, but after the first year was completely and utterly delightful. Um, not that we didn't have hard times. We did, but the spirit was working in and through and among us, and it was amazing. Um, and it has been that way here as well good times or bad, whether we've um, agreed or disagreed with each other, we have found ways to be Christ's body together. And I don't know that I could ask for anything more um, in a congregation or in a faith community and a faith family. So 
I wanted to say to you on this day, happy anniversary, and thank you so much um, for the last nine years um, and what they have meant to me in my life. Um, and I hope they have meant in yours. I look forward to seeing you on Sunday. Um, and then um, don't forget that there's an annual meeting on the 14th that I promise will be from 9.30 till 10 o'clock and there'll be plenty of time for you to get here for the parking lot worship. Um, until then, dear ones, be well, be kind, Christ is with you.